Hey everybody, welcome back to the show. We are going to be tasting wow. some fine wines and some delicious food right now. Yes, of course, the uh, Vancouver Magazine Wine Awards have come out and this is so popular and it causes sellouts in all the vintages that they name. Uh, we're going to talk about those as well as some great food because we are, of course, talking about the marriage between wine and food with DJ Kearney, sommelier instructor, and Frank Pabst, executive chef, Blue Water Cafe and Raw Bar. Hello. Hello, you guys. Hello. So are you? Okay, oh, DJ. Hello. I'm so Hello. happy to be back. We are starting with the wines, and you were kind enough to pour one that is yeah. so fragrant. Tell us about this delicious little number. This is our uh, winner, category winner, medium white. It is uh, Chablis. It's made from the Chardonnay grape in a very, very cool part of Burgundy. It is unoaked. It's just delicate, it's leasy, it's got fantastic sort of stoniness and you know and lemony. And deliciousness too. I yeah. didn't realize she believe it was, is it always made with a Chardonnay grape or is it? Yes yeah. it is. Okay. Yeah. Wow. Now it Frank, we're pairing well. this one with uh, the mussels today. Why is this such a great pairing for what you're doing? It's a classic pairing and uh, the dish that I will be serving tonight at the big night event is a, uh, based on the French classic, the mouclade, which is a dish made with mussels steamed in white wine and then uh, um, enriched with cream and it's, it's rather a thick creamy sauce, flour based sauce and I will nice. make a lighter version where I add a touch of uh, curry a little thyme, a little lemon juice, Just and to make it much lighter. Notes. Exactly, we don't want to overpower the wine, well, and it's not like the bold flavors of uh, East Indian restaurants. It's mm -hmm. uh, very a delicately. Softer. And DJ, yeah. this softer. is what I love about Big Night that you guys do. You start with the wine, the award-winning wines from Vancouver Magazine, and you force these guys uh, to match the food <laughs> to the wine, because exactly. usually it goes the other way, right? Yeah. You're trying to find... Well, yeah. the chefs, have them, they taste the wine. Right? The category winners are, are chosen. I choose the restaurants and the, and the wine. And then they, a chef like um, Chef Frank will taste the wine. He may. Is ask that a tough part of the job, Frank, <laughs> to have to taste the wine and yes, absolutely. taste it again? And, 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 uh, uh, and Andrea is very helpful with right. that, and yeah. I never spit. Yeah. <laughs> there we go. Frank has a crack wine team, so they pitch in as well. You always want to, to start with the weight of the wine first. So you assess that, then you choose a dish that's not going to overpower it. This wine is defined by acidity, mm -hmm. and so Frank knows that there's lemon juice in the in yeah, the sauce, beautiful. and it's going to balance. Now let's everything. move on to some of the other wines that of we're going to feature right. today. What is oh. our next one, DJ? Well, let's talk about the best in show. Okay. Shall okay. we? Um, this oh, you, you don't want to. You don't want to get. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I, I can finish that like that. <laughs> don't take Frank Urban Ross, wine. by the way, is proud to have our new cab sponsor on the show. <laughs> so this uh, this was our best in show, and this was also France's year. We had uh, five of our categories winners are French wines. Oh, Frank's Frank doing you have right. to, you have to die. Oh, oh, quitter! Oh, Man quitter. Uh, tell us Thank about you. this whole go. process, DJ, because this is an undertaking uh, that you guys do. How many wines do you usually start with? We, we start, um, this year we started with uh, over 800. Um, we, oh, over okay. three days with a crack team of uh, 16 judges, two masters of wine, five sommeliers of the year, the best educators and writers, narrowed it down to very, it was a difficult process. To are there fights? Are there arguments? Oh, is there... there are smackdowns. Yeah, I can smackdowns. imagine. It's very, very difficult. Uh, so tell us about the, uh, I mean, this is just a beautiful it's wine. Very tight, but in all the yeah. best possible ways. You know, this is Beaujolais. It's Cru Beaujolais, so from a very special village called um, Bruy. It's made from the Gamay grape. It was our, mm. um, our uh, light red winner. Yep. And again, it's, uh, it's juicy, it's fresh, it's got gorgeous, gorgeous, Cherry, I love the way fruit. you guys categorize light yeah. red, yeah. heavy red. So you can really make your pick. That's done deliberately, right? This is a, this is a competition to help wine consumers. Yeah. So at the end of it, we come out with a, a magazine and a guide that can be picked up at BCL stores. Your little Bible of what to try. Fine liquor stores, and it's it's got a list in there to keep you drinking all year long. As you the should. Value is fantastic, and the variation is amazing. And I'm going to quote you on that. DJ <laughs> would like to keep you drinking <laughs> all, all year, year long. long. Okay, what have we added to the mussels here, Frank? So right now we started mussel with uh, leeks, celery, uh, some onions, and some curry powder and some butter. Then we put the mussels in, the cleaned mussels, add a little bit of the wine that we're serving with them, mm -hmm. put a lid on, and let it cook for like 30 seconds a minute till they uh, pop open. This looks really easy. It is very easy. Very. Quick. And Very then quick. And we're going to finish off with a little bit of apple. Why do you exactly. do that? 
just to bring a little Christmas and a little fruitiness in there, not to make it sweet by any means. But to add more acidity as well. Exactly, yeah. because yeah. these are green apples, are Granny Smith apples, so it's not the. Uh, uh, DJ, the how much versions. fun is it for you to see the food coming together with the wine, uh, you know, and so specific and, and so meant to be in the pairing? It is so satisfying. I mean, wine is made for food, and the pairings, the, the, the chefs just blow me away every single year, and it brings the wines to life, and it, it makes me very proud. Look at that, so pretty. And let's uh, talk about our last I managed to day. finish okay, that one. Okay, okay. Wow, much Mike. to my credit, thank Mike you. Mine's not shocked. a shooter. I hey, it's Friday! It's Friday! <laughs> <laughs> well, this is the big red? Um, all the, the, uh, the tasting is, is blind right, okay. over three days, okay. and uh, it's just also so fantastic to see how well BC does. This was our rich red winner. Um, it is Painted Rock Syrah. I'm gonna try and big, not drop bold, this. A big, bold, fruity, but you know, it's got minerals, it's got cojones, it's well, got backbone. You it's can really cojones? see, it's got cojones. You can yes. see the maturation of the BC wines. Mm -hmm. uh, oh. I mean, almost year to year, you know, as the vines get older and as everybody figures out the viticulture and all these things coming together in BC. We have come of age. Wow. And, you know, this is a fairly new grape in the Okanagan, Ooh. Syrah, but it uh, it just is doing spectacular things it has and a very great quickly. Great nose. Yeah. Oh. Well, thank you oh, both. Delicious, meaty. Frank. Thank of course, you, you can mm -hmm. uh, visit Blue Water Cafe and Raw Bar. And uh, if you want to pick up Vancouver Magazine, we want to mention that there's two issues. Of course, there's this month's issue of the magazine, and then you can pick up the special wine, Top 100 Best Wines. It's free for the month of February at BC Liquor Store, so make sure you grab it so you can drink all year long. Salud. 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 Chin, chin. There we go. Chin. There we go. Cheers. Cheers.